I got an email from a guy who's been reading my book since 1997. He said he got it on off of Amazon when it first started. Well, thank you, sir, for buying all my books. He wants to know which one I like the most. Of all the books I've written, let's, let's take to nonfiction. I would say my favorite is Date Young Women, the first one. Because it's like your first kid. <laughs> it took five years, rewritten many times, changed and changed and changed until it had the right voice. It sounds like two men sitting in a bar. One's been there, done that, explaining to the other guy how you date young women. But the book I enjoy reading the most is this latest book here, 2066, Overthrow Barack II. <laughs> I had so much fun writing that book, I can't even tell you. I would stop and laugh my ass off in the middle of a sentence, okay? I'll give you one of the, my favorite sentences in the whole book. Obama's got to get a new wife because he's killed Michelle after she was elected president with him running as vice president in 2028. Then he uh, declares martial law and runs the country forever until he gets a son. He sent all his uh, minions out looking for a new wife. So they had a Miss America contest. And they picked the top 10. And he made all 10 come to his mansion in uh, Martha Vineyard. And we're all in a big naked swim. He gets rid of three of the first three. He gets rid of are the ones with no ass, no big ass anyway. And uh, then he has a blowjob contest. So that takes three days for him to get blown by seven different women. The last girl can't do it with her shit. He gets mad. And then his handler says, that's the one you want. That's Vanessa Williams' daughter. That's a that's black royalty. You got to marry her. So he says, "Oh, she can't suck a dick worth a damn." So he sends to Los Angeles for Monica Lewinsky. He sends his Lear jet. She flies back there. She's a middle-aged, frumpy-looking woman, but she can still deliver presidential-level blowjobs. <laughs> That's the fun, the sentence I enjoyed writing the most. There are other funny, funny things in there that I enjoyed. And, and my friend Greg read the book and he was almost pissing his pants. He, he thinks I'm going to get sued. I hope I get sued. Publicity is hard to get. So thank you for the question. My first book, nonfiction, is Date Young Woman, my favorite fiction book. A very close second is uh, is this one. I created this character. She's a combination of, of Modesty Blaze and James Bond. But she doesn't do any uh, physical combat with men because that's horseshit. She kills everybody with a pocket pistol or stabs them in the throat. And uh, she finds out from her bisexual lover, oh boy, that's fun, her bisexual lover who is her inside man at the FBI, that there is a, a CIA FBI task force formed to stop the kidnapping of young girls off the streets of LA. Every winter between uh, late, right after Christmas all the way up until March, they kidnap every year 30, 35 girls disappear. And there's no complaint filed, nobody investigates because they're all from the ghetto. Any white girl is white trash uh, from Bell Gardens or someplace where nobody's gonna give a shit if she's gone. But they don't take any white women from the suburbs because that'll bring a, bring a whole police investigation. It's run by the KGB, and it's a big finance source. They sell all these girls to pedophiles and rich people who want, want a girlfriend, a white slave for all practical purposes. And they sell them on the, on the uh, yacht of the uh, Prince of Saudi Arabia every year in Cannes, and they've been doing it uh, this the year this takes place is 1984. And they've been selling them there for 10 years without anybody noticing. So she finds out, she sets up this big group of black guys and Mexicans in LA because she knows the police and they, they have a truce and they all help follow these uh, kidnappers to a funky motel in San Pedro. They find out which ship they're going on. They follow them all the way to Europe. And the white witch flies to Naples and deals with her mafia buddy who runs uh, all of Europe. And he helps her with the men and supplies. And they take over, the, they commandeer the uh, sheik's yacht at one in the morning. They uh, Everybody runs upstairs and, and they uh, 
make them jump off the side of the ship and let the little girl shoot them in the water floundering around 35 pedophiles and rich white people, all shot to death by little girls who were going to be slaves. That was the most fun writing it. It was also satisfying that there is some justice, at least in my books, <laughs> there is justice. So thank you for the question. I hope you read all my books. Everybody, read all my books. They're wonderful. I enjoy writing every one of them. There isn't a single one I didn't enjoy writing. I wouldn't have read it. <laughs> I'm working on White Witch 13 right now, and I'm having a hell of a time. I think my motivation is down, so I'm just going to put it in the back for a while. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Don Steele, John White is out.